I always tell my friends, money is good. When you have money, you find it helps you to afford certain things that uh, you might not have had if you were broke. So money, but money as well. The Bible says the love of money is the root cause of all evil. Money is a good servant, veteran, but a very bad master. So I want you to note this. If in the middle of the month, when end month before end month comes, you find you are stressed, all you think about is money, there's a problem. There could be a level of greed. If you find that you borrow too much, by the time your salary comes, you find you have no money because you have to pay back the debt, there is a problem with money management in your life. If you find that you borrow money and you're not paying back that money as you agreed, there's a problem, most likely greed, that is in there. Then at times you find because of that you start avoiding people, running away from people, and by extension, if you're a Christian, you start avoiding coming to church because you know that you'll be held accountable. At times it even extends where you find people taking each other to court Poor judgment will kill you. And so money, as I said, is a good servant, but a very bad master. The question you've got to ask yourself, have you allowed money to master you, or are you using money to be a servant? You will know. God has put a spirit within you which will help you, or who will help you to know when you are not content with what God has given you. The other issue we have to look at is it is important to be okay with what you have. Many a times we have this false belief, thinking that if I only got this, I'll be more happier. If I only got that, I'll be more happier. Let me tell you for truth, as I've lived for a few years on this earth, if you're not happy, that's what we call contentment. If you're not happy with what you have currently, even if you get how much tomorrow, it will not give you joy or happiness. They say money can buy bed, but money will not buy you sleep. Money can buy food, but money will not bring you joy or happiness. It only facilitates to enable that. So if you think by you having more, by you accumulating more or getting more salary, you'll be more happier, forget my friend. It is important to understand that money is a good slave, but a very bad master. Be content with the little that you have. Am I saying you don't work hard to a better tomorrow? You gotta work hard because money also is not harvested on top of mountains. No, you gotta work hard, sharpen your skills so that you can. For that is where now you need life coaching. Come to us, we'll train you how to be a good master of money, how to work and make money work for you and to make yourself happy with what you have.